All right, Coach. Uh, first season at Auburn, making to the postseason first time. You're the first Auburn coach to do that in your first season here. So how exciting is it to to come in and, and get the team some some bonus games at the end of the year and grow for next year? You know, it's always good when you're – when you don't have to be done early in March, um, I think it's great. It's a great opportunity for our young ladies. And any postseason play is always good, especially, you know, to help you get ready and, and build on for your upcoming season next year. As someone who went through it as a player and you've gone through it as a coach, how beneficial is it to get that championship tournament atmosphere and those games in? How helpful is that for the players? It's good. It's always it's almost like a whole new season, like a whole new opportunity that, you know, has been presented to you and you can pretty much do whatever, you know, you can change stuff, you can make up stuff, you can, you know, just just have some fun with it because it's a lot of teams that are done right now. Getting to play at home so, and this is a place that your team's played well all year. How beneficial is that to get to come in and play at home in front of your fans and not have to travel early on in the tournament? It's definitely great not to have to travel. <laughs> uh, but it's great to be able to be right here in front of our fans. I mean, we've got such good fans, and I think they might be even more excited than our young ladies to, you know, get a chance to watch another basketball game. So Coach, starting off with UAB, just talk about what you've seen out of the Blazers and what to expect from them. Yeah, Archer um, has been there almost eight years, I think, and, you know, she's a really good coach. They got a really good team. Their guard play is really good. They're one, twos, and threes. They're their leading scorers, um, and that's really the bulk of their offense um, coming from their guards who can shoot the three, who can put the ball on the floor, attack the basket. So it'll definitely be a matchup where, you know, where we got to be ready to defend. What would be the keys for Auburn against a team that's so guard-oriented like that? You know, we got to be able to guard them off the bounce. I mean, they really attack the rim extremely hard. Um, but in doing that, also be able to get out there and contest the shot. So, you know, one key, of course, is always defense. Um, I think we can get the ball inside. They're all a little small in the post. Um, we need to get the ball inside, whether it be, you know, attacking the basket ourselves, our own post-ups, um, and then also as well as take care of the ball. I think sometimes we have a tendency to turn the ball over just a little too much. I know you gave the team a week off for spring break. Uh, you've had two, three practices since then. What have you seen out of them since they've come back from the break? Yeah, I think they've come back refreshed. You know, it's always good when you can get some time off. And I just thought it was beneficial. You know, we've had a lot of injuries and, you know, a lot of kids playing a lot of minutes. So any time that we can get some rest, it gives them a chance to come back and feel fresh. And we're seeing a little bit of energy out of them. Right here with senior Blanche Alverson. Blanche, just talk about it's your senior year. And go back to the postseason. You know, what's it feel like to get to extend your senior year a little bit longer? Um, I'm excited about it. I think it's a great opportunity for the program, a great opportunity for us to keep on playing and um, to show that we we still have some in us. Um, I feel like we haven't we haven't reached our potential yet this year, and I think we have a lot to prove coming into this postseason. How excited were you last night to a find out that you made it, and b to find out that you get to play at least one more game in Auburn Arena? I'm excited about it. I think you know. Um, I think we play really well at home, and we, our crowd brings great energy, and it's always fun when we're playing at home, regardless of the outcome. And um, I think we, we, we come out and we fight. We fight for our fans, and we fight for Auburn. Um, so I think I'm excited about it. You played in this tournament as a sophomore. You know, thinking back, it seems a long time ago, but how beneficial was that postseason experience, that tournament experience, that win or go home that impacted you through the rest of your career? Um, I think it was. I think it was awesome. Um, I think you know that year. That year we were kind of disappointed. We thought you know we had a really good chance to be in the NCAA tournament coming into that, coming into my sophomore year. But we, we took it. We took advantage of that. We wanted to come in and, and um, just fight for everything we had. Um, that that postseason play and you know it was a good experience going somewhere we've never been before, playing that one and done um, kind of atmosphere, which is different. Um, and it's a lot that is. Coming in, like our our freshmen was were like that in the SEC tournament this year. They had never done that one and done. So I think it you know it just brings that experience that that it really is one and done. And if you don't leave it all on the floor, you may not get another chance to.